Okay, what's up you guys? Today we are at Nilai and we are going to do our first uh, Miku climb. Okay, I've never done Miku climb before so this one I simply plot lah. Hopefully we don't get lost and don't hit highways lah. Really I simply plot one. So Miku is about 60 plus km from here. So our total ride today is 126 km and Miku climb uh, got 30% gradient way. 30% don't know how we're gonna survive but let's see how it goes so I'll see you on the road Where's the other thing? Our first attempt using the tube uh, what the lap chong they call it the what? Dry meat uh. don't know what you call it uh. Not not your level Puncture tubeless puncture I haven't start already puncture. Nasib bike got me. If I if I'm not here, they all don't know what to do. One, I save. Nasib bike got Daniel. Uh, mm. So nasib bike. So today lunch uh, on uh, lunch on <laughs> lunch on Marcus today. Okay, now I remember it's called Bacon Strip. Uh. <laughs> got smoke come out. One. Oh, I got effect. Ready this one. Oh. Okay, to be honest, a lot of us do not know what to expect with this route because it's all our first time. Uh, but Miku, Miku, Miku climb has been quite viral lately. Like, everybody's been doing it. So, let's see if we survive. Uh, yep. Let's see how's the ride going to be. I think it's going to be a hard day today. Right? Check it out. I was hoping it to be a bit more cooling, but it's going to be a hot day. So let's see what happens today. This route will be interesting because it's a new route as I said. Uh, we'll be hitting about, let's see, uh, Mantin Climb. Then we are hitting, um, of course, the Miku Climb. Coming back, we'll hit Mantin Climb again, so three climbs. Miku Climb is a scary one, uh, 3km of up to about 30%. So because I told them maybe at km 50, la, we stop and makan. La. Because our breakfast is at 70 km, so let's see what happens. <sighs> Morning. Ah, uh, <coughs> oh, nowadays ah, uh, COVID cases ah. Uh, <sighs> Crazy way, five digits. People cough also, you scared. You cough also, you scared. You hear people cough also, you also start to feel like a cough. Scary way. Stay safe, stay safe. Good morning, good morning. Oh, really? We're just cycling through all the towns, eh? We're just literally cycling through all the towns. So far, so good. About 8 km of rolling hills. But there were some really nasty potholes as well. So, so far, so good. This here last week. This is uh, Bukit Tikus, right here. Last week when we did the RC coaching ride. Here is Bukit Tikus and now we're going to waste the mountain climb. Ooh, 
Is that a cut? <laughs> had a bad fall. Okay, you have a cut. You had, had a bad fall. So, had a bad fall. Hit the cup here. Yeah. Had a bad fall. See what happened to the bike. Cry out. Hey, yeah, okay. so I'm okay with this guy yeah, listening. Honestly, I think the bike took most of it back. Yes. Pressing the bike. Yes. Yes. Everyone you okay? I'm okay. Better bike. Uh. It's one of the days. One of those days. Uh. It's one. It's one of the days. Uh. No need teachers, trust me. I'm a mechanic. So yeah, epic ride failed. And no grab car. Ah, Sienna. Email Bay I've done that. Leave one behind. <laughs> what do you say again? Leave no one behind. Oh, they all command me to maintain oh, town. So oh, so sweet. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, all of them cancel their ride for me. Oh, gone lah my camera. <laughs> okay, so pedaling back slowly. And Marcus sacrificed his ride to command me. Oh, so sweet. My friend, so sweet. So, I think, is if you ask me, this accident could have avoided. Uh, I think the train should have kept at the outer lane because of the curb area. Uh. I think if we kept at the outer lane, which is a wider area for everyone, could be a safer. So I'm gonna slow, slowly cycle back to Mountain Town and try to grab a grab. Okay, so, got a grab car. See? Everybody helping me. Oh, well, uh, crack already here. So, so I'm gonna go back to Nilai. Uh, this good souls all helping me. I'm gonna see them soon. Okay. Bye bye everyone. Bye. Thanks. Okay. Bye. Bye bye. Okay, bye. Richard. Richard. Any call? So now I'm in the grab car and we are going to continue the ride so it is what it is uh, this thing just happened I suppose uh, but a nice guy here so he's going to take me back uh, interestingly he is actually deaf and mute which is interesting I'm going to end the ride now so I think this um, wait let me put on my seatbelt So, uh, cycling this part in parcel, uh, accident does happen. Uh. Uh, besides screwing up my my 21,000 ringgit frame set, it is what it is. So now I guess I need to either repair, so I'll probably vlog my repair journey of repairing my bike. The good thing is uh, I'm safe. Uh, I'm gonna probably just go back home and wash up and check on my, my bruise and stuff. Uh. I think it should be okay, like, nothing much. Uh. What's supposed to be an epic cycle route, Miku, Miku challenge. Right, you know, I, I probably you know made the ride not as enjoyable for everyone, but I guess and I said like, it is what it is. It's part and parcel of cycling, uh, you know. Uh, not having any accident is probably uh, uh, impossible. Yes. Ah, what a waste! There are so many things I want to talk about today on this ride, but I guess it is what it is. Uh, managed to get a grab car, took me back. Uh, we were about 17 km away. It's kind of sad that I did not finish this ride. I was looking forward to it, so... <sighs> it is what it is. I mean, I'm, I'm sad because, you know, every weekend we look forward to the ride. Scratched. Lips. Yeah, I can see that it's like a bit bigger. It's like... 
Oh boy. Yep, so welcome to the world of cycling where this will happen. This will happen. And yeah, I guess that's the that's the vlog for today. A very short vlog. Um so today's vlog is how I broke my 21,000 ringgit frame <laughs> I guess I won't be selling this frame Once I repair it, I'll probably still use it I uh. won't be selling it uh. <sighs> Okay, what, what, how, what am I feeling right now? To be honest of course, I feel disappointed lah. I was really looking forward to this ride. Right, Miku Climb could have been an amazing epic ride. It could have been an amazing epic ride. Uh, even though no matter how safe we try to be cycling, I think this will happen. Uh, but we try, of course. Uh, don't joke about it. It's serious cycling. You're on open road and all. It's definitely dangerous lah. And... I think right now what I'm feeling is disappointment lah. Uh, I'm glad nothing happened to me. I'm glad I'm safe. I'm glad I'm healthy. Uh, I'm glad that uh, I'm alive and no major injury. But I am disappointed in the sense that, yeah, it's sad that I broke my frame. <laughs> and I think what is more sad, well, while, while I was on the way back in the car, right, I think, I think the saddest part was facing the reality that I might not be able to cycle for another one month until I fix the framer. I think that is the disappointment that I have right now that I will not be able to cycle for one month until I sort out this frame. Yeah, because like I say, you know, cycling, cycling is a lifestyle. You know, cycling is a lifestyle. Cycling is a routine that you fell in love with a cycling that you know a routine that you fell in love with in the sense that you look forward every week to just go out and pedal and cycle oh, flies are you know flying around my blood <laughs> so right now i guess my my, my biggest feeling uh, emotion right now is the disappointment that i will not be able to cycle for at least three weeks to a month until i fix my frame <sighs> sad lah but it is what it is I'm glad I'm okay. Uh. I'm glad. Uh, thank you to the group as well. You know the group. You know uh, Marcus and Daniel and 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 uh, Lionel, everyone and Tong and all of you guys. I should say about could have been an epic ride. All I can say is when I come back, I have to train back because one month of no cycling is gonna be difficult to train back to the current fitness. So I have to figure out how to do that. And all I can say is I'm gonna do my best to maintain my fitness throughout the weeks of downtime and I want to revenge the Miku climb that's all I can say huh? well that's all folks sorry for a disappointing vlog but that's again like I say it's reality of life in cycling it happens uh, lesson learned for me maybe next time don't follow too close in the peloton which I'm quite used to and maybe in a peloton point of view uh, when someone's in front, do predict on the road safety. Uh, you know, if there is curbs like this, uh, best is to go outside a bit. But I'm not blaming on everyone. Uh. I think the biggest fault is on my side, following too close. Uh. So it is what it is. I'm going back home to see my wife. Um, quick access of... Quick assessment of the body. Lips, chin, chest, knee. Uh, of course, wait, put my pocket here and here. The best part is, after I came home, my wife said, are you okay? Most important, you're okay. Don't worry about the bike. Bike can buy new. <laughs> my wife said bike can buy new. That's the best part. Uh, so, hey, I'll be back, guys. I'll be back. I'm not giving up. So now, uh, I think every bike crash should also go see doctor lah. So I'm gonna go to the clinic and check, get the doctor to check on my bruises just in case. 
Oh, not much people. Let's get myself checked out. Okay, uh, the doctor came me up, gave me a titanus shot. I think the titanus shot was more painful than the fall. Uh. So, he patched me up. So far so good, so clean the wound and all. Uh, no, no, no rib fracture, no bone broken, so that's good. So, waiting for medicine and let's see. Okay lah, that's it for today lah. One of the worst, saddest vlog ever. But don't worry, I will get, I will, I will come back, I will definitely come back. So I also contacted uh, Stock lah to see whether uh, they can help me out and see how. Well, definitely have to get a new bike lah. Don't know it's a good thing or a bad thing. Don't know why inside, deep deep inside, I'm happy. <laughs> Best thing is my wife already approved my visa to buy a new bike. Well, anyway, again, I'm okay. Just a bit of uh, scratches here and there. I, I survive. So I'll see you soon. I'll see you guys next week. If there's anything to vlog or vlog bloody. I'll see you guys real soon, guys. You guys take care. God bless. And well, God bless you all. And be safe on the road. Shit happens, but be safe.